Hey guys, my name is Dr. Konstantin Payson. I'm a board certified gastroenterologist at Triborough GI. I want to talk to you today about eosinophilic esophagitis. Some people call this asthma of the esophagus. It isn't that commonly talked about, but it is becoming much more common. It's basically where allergic type cells, similar to those in asthma, or if you have um, uh, eczema or something like that, the deposit in your esophagus, and can, they can cause chest pain, they can cause severe reflux, they can cause food to get stuck. It's most common in men uh, ages 20 to 30, uh, but it can happen at any age, uh, in any sex. So diagnosis of eosinophilic esophagitis is made very reliably with an upper endoscopy and biopsy. Um, the biopsy then has to be reviewed by a pathologist under a microscope to get the definitive diagnosis. Once you do have the diagnosis, the treatment is focused on eliminating the foods that might be causing the allergic reaction in the esophagus and acid suppression. If those uh, are not working, then you may need steroids uh, to further uh, suppress the allergic response. Once the uh, disease is brought under control, uh, it has very good outcomes. Um, if you'd like to know more about eosinophilic esophagitis, uh, feel free to call our office at 718-332-0600 uh, and comment and like on this video.